Hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome to Mother Gunship, sort of. This is the gun crafting range. The, uh, the demo isn't out yet, and the game it won't be out for another two months, give or take. Um, but, for the time being, uh, let's see, Joe. Oh, shit, it is Joe, right? Yeah. I'm gonna double check. If I, if I got it wrong, I'll start this over. Yeah, Joe, Joe Mirabella, yep. Got it. I've met him in person. I should remember his name. Um, he was kind enough to personally send these these copies over to me, uh, so that I could mess around with it. Uh, so this is this is really just going to be super bare bones gun crafting and messing around with some combos. I don't think we're going to be able to play too much of this. Um, I don't even know exactly what's entailed, but mainly we're going to be able to take a good look. Soldier, this is your commander. Before we get you out there saving Earth from the mother gunship, we need to make sure you know how to craft some guns. Chief Gungeoneer Wilkinson will take it from here. Yeah, I'm the on-site certified maintenance gunjineer of Joe's Arms and Armory. Gun-shaped solutions for alien armada-shaped problems. I am contractually obligated to say that part or I will be ejected into space. First things first, I put some free gun parts out for you. Go grab them. Okay, so we've got a bunch of, uh, we've got two different Activate slots. Activate any gun part with the price set to zero. That means it's free. This is where I tell you you've done an excellent job picking up those parts. Head to the crafting bench, please. Okay, can I pick up anything else that's free? No, in fact, it looks like I'm down. The sensitivity is way high. Usually I have to crank it up, but in this case, oof. I gotta turn it down. Uh, let's do two. Now smoothing's off to begin with. The crafting That's... bench is at the end of the room. After you activate it, I'll unlock the shooting range. That's still pretty damn high. Uh, let's keep cranking it down. I mean, it could just be my mouse. Nope, it's just the game. Can I turn the voices up any? Nope, this is at maximum volume. Activate the crafting station. Make it Shut up. Okay. Welcome to Joe's Arms and Armory Crafting Stations, where the only limit to your destructive capabilities is your imagination. The secret behind Joe's Crafting Station is in its unique mix of modular parts. It's like playing with blocks, just highly explosive. This is the gun you are crafting. The glowing... When you select a socket, you have access to your inventory, where you can select parts. You have three tabs in your inventory. Connectors add more sockets. Do funny things to your entire gun. And barrels? Well, those should be obvious. There are only two rules. First, parts have to physically fit where you want to put them. And second, barrels need to face forward. You can thank the insurance companies for that. Go ahead and try adding a new part now. Okay. Uh, let's see. How do I... I don't want to move it there. Uh, barrels. Chain gun, line blaster. Yep. So it looks like once I've unlocked a part, Add, it's just there. Or rotate parts however you want, but keep an eye on your energy costs. Every part you add costs more energy to fire. So sure, build a 40 barrel gun if you want. Just be prepared to only fire once before having to wait for the recharge. Okay, and oh, I see. We are limited on things. Oh, that's fine. Uh, finish crafting. crafting. Excellent. Let's get you on the range then. Your goal? Don't die. The less you die, the better you make me look to my superiors. Good luck. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Okay, yeah, you're right. I was not applying the the change. Okay, Don't mind preparing the room. We're just cleaning up the live fire range from the mess the last recruit left. I love the visual style. It's a lot cleaner than Tower of Guns was, but it's a very clear, uh... Oh, yeah. That's similar. It's a little choppy. Okay. This is familiar. A little faster pace, but definitely familiar. Max jumps plus. Oh, I've got four. Oh, I'm so glad that that's just straight up a thing. That is going to be nice. Oh, hello, friends. Okay. So this is... You survived your first live fire chamber. Now you're heading back to the armory. Don't be afraid to build a better gun before you head back to the range. You'll need it. 
If you picked up any money during your combat training, you can use it to buy more gun parts. Each time you come back here, they'll replenish. So feel free to stock up. Or save up for those heftier parts. The best guns don't grow on trees, you know. I wish I could tell you that you could get used to the Colonel, but you really don't. Energy, fireworks, more chain gun, ricochet mod. Uh, let's grab the ricochet mod. I think that might be a cap. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, let's see. So we want to do... Okay, ricochet mod, bounce plus one. Does add energy cost, but I'm, I'm going to make a ricochet. I'm just going to mess around with this. Back we go. As the, this feels so good. Oh yeah, this is going to be... I can I can already tell this is going to be great. Ow, fire. Ow, didn't see him. Ow, everything is pain. Oh, I'm out of energy. Uh, not out of health though. Okay, so I gotta watch that. This gun is a little bit pricier than... Um, I think what I might do... Oh, oh, oh. oh yeah! The old, uh, the old six-shot gun buddies. Yeah, it does feel like this is much, much faster paced than, um... Than Tower of Guns ever was. But that's not necessarily a bad thing. Tower of Guns could be downright graceful at times, but maybe a little bit sluggish. Until you got to the higher difficulties, at which point it became <laughs> impossible. Oh, I had fun with that. Ah, let's see, do we have anything else? We've got a thing. Are these all just exits? So yeah, they're all just exits. Complete. Well done. Now's a great time to tell a friend about our mission to destroy the mother gunship. Wilkinson, tell him. There's a gunship. It's, uh, it's called the mother gunship, and destroying it is uh, our mission. Splendid description, Wilkinson. The Resistance will need all the help we can get if we plan on taking that thing down. We need everyone. You, your best friend, your most distant cousin. Forgotten 90s era actors who show up on reality TV shows. You can just leave while he's talking. He usually doesn't notice. I mean, really, tell everyone. Football players, canines, your first crush, people who actually like Chaucer, Visigoths. People from Wisconsin, doctors, even the non-medical kind, people who still use the default password on their routers, people who you only know from holiday parties. Pilots and their cool uniforms, that'd be good to add. Politicians who aren't on social media, meteorologists, you know, for all the meteors. So, yeah, just about everyone. Okay, you made the biggest, baddest gun out there, prove it. <laughs> Share a picture of the gun. All right. Is there... I just want to share a picture of this now that it's telling me to share a picture of it. <laughs> just be like, I'm not I'm not sure why you're asking me to share this right now. Now, Joe, I have con I have concerns. OK, so we want to do. Connector. OK, so I got some things to talk about as far as this game for all obvi for obvious reasons. Collision conflict. What? What butts are you? What butts are you? Uh, uh hmm. Okay, that's this isn't helpful. How do I? I want to rotate which socket it's it's going. Okay, well I can do that. I kind of wish I could get rid of the whole thing. Okay, maybe if I do connector two side. Uh, burp, burp. controlling this is a little awkward. Okay, there we go. Um, but so this is backwards, actually. Let's re let's remove both of these. Uh, I'm going to be particular about this. So th obviously, this is a demo. This is not the full thing. If you're going into this thinking like, "Yeah, this is Mother Gunship," no, this is part of Mother Gunship, but it's a very good indication of what Mother Gunship is and will be, um, which is good. I don't know. I really, really enjoy uh, the predecessor, Tower of Guns. Um, And, let's see. Trying to make this nice and aesthetic. Uh, let's do caps. Do ricochet mod? Really? Really? Every single one of these is collision. Alright. Oh, back we go. 
Remove this. Uh, let's see. Back to attach mode. But I really enjoy Tower of Guns. It practically... I'm not going to say it launched my channel, because that I think that might be uh, a bit of an exaggeration. Uh, but it made such a massive difference. Okay, I guess this isn't going to work the way I want it to. Uh, we'll have to get more connectors or something. Let's see, can I just do a lava module and... It really won't let me do anything else there. Alright, whatever. This one. Lava module, ricochet, and... Can I just cram some of these in here? I'm not going to be able to commentate over this. Fair warning. This game is, um... Well, there's a lot. Let's do a line blaster. Okay, this is going to be one long-ass gun. I probably could have done with that... Okay, I guess it's not nearly as long as I thought it was going to be. That's good. Uh, let's see. Oh, let's go in here. See some really neat stuff coming from this gun crafting. Me too. I Tower of... One of the problems with uh, Tower of Guns is there were just baseline a handful of guns. And I... Oh. Oh. Okay, the napalm mod is a problem. I should not... I should not use this. I need to GTFO from this design. It is nothing but bad ideas. Ow, this guy sucks. Okay, there we go. But yeah, uh, Tower of Guns lacked variety. Uh, it, it was fun. It was fun as shit. Uh, don't get me wrong. But the... One of the ultimate problems I had with the game was just that it, um... It, after a while, every run kind of felt samey. Oh, nope. Needed those. Whoop! Uh, and so, uh... And so, like... Hi! Too close! And so, like, this, the gun crafting system, and, like, a bunch of the associated mechanics, they're gonna make this feel so much better. So much better. Okay, that's some kind of weird spin bot thing. I love the visual design. It's nice and bright and colorful. I don't know what those are. Probably energy tokens? Maybe? Give or take? I'm gonna have to switch this guy out. ASAP. Okay, there's something else bouncing around down here, right? No? I swear there's like a mobile enemy. I might also get rid of the uh, ricochet bullets. They're not helping me that much. But yeah, uh, the lack of unique upgrades. Yup. And so this is almost kind of a perfect... Um, this is really just a perfect response to Tower of Guns. Everything... From what I can tell, everything that Tower of Guns did or lacked, this game has. Three chambers that's... complete. Excellent. Sooner or later, this combat loop gets the best of all of us, though. So keep improving your gun. Wilkinson, what are the odds of this recruit survival? Why would you ask that? They're standing right there. You're right. Who cares about odds? Do your best. Like, I'm not even trying to exaggerate here. Let's grab another shotgun. I don't want any more ricochet mods. Didn't get as much money from that one. What's the pulse box do? I guess we'll find out. Uh, I should probably fire this thing before I leave. In the future. Um, uh, let's see. Let's see how much Joe added in uh, first. Well, so part of it is, uh, this is actually, uh, I believe, he has like a whole studio under him to some degree. Like, this is not just Joe anymore. This is, um, this is like multiple people. Let's try and do this. Uh, this isn't like just a, a one-man project. Uh, which to me is kind of massive in its own way. Okay. Uh, let's go back for a second. I do hope they uh, change the UI around a little bit for this. Um, on this for like the, the mouse controls. It feels very like console focused, but maybe that's just me. Okay, so we got a bunch of barrels. I don't really want that much. Okay, so that's not gonna work. What's the pulse box do? Hell if I know. Looks rad, though. Uh, 
Uh, do any of these? Okay, the chain guns. Wow, it looks like a little robot. This almost looks like an enemy that you've run into. Okay. Um, anyway, finish crafting. Let's see if this is good enough. I like the looks looks of this. Um, let's see, we don't want the lava. I think the, the lava was a problem. Let's see. We do have some connectors. Oh, I might be able to change some things. Barrel not facing forward. Caps. Okay. Lo oh, yeah. That's fire mine. 15% chance. Okay. 39. 34. Yeah, let's do it without the uh, the ricochet mods. I don't think they're that, that helpful for me. So let's just go... Let's go kind of Daka. Daka with the, the pulse shot going through. We'll, we'll see how this works. Um... That worked out mostly. Fuck. The melee attack is a huge improvement too. I think you get the ability to have two, um, two guns eventually as well. Uh, you might even be able to have it immediately. I'm not entirely clear on that one. Hard to say actually. I, I don't know. Wish I did. Uh, one other really, really cool thing about this game that I should probably also mention, it's multiplayer. Online. Uh, so I will be able to play this uh, with my friends. Not... Four chambers complete. I bet you could do this all day. You must have that sort of time, but uh, I don't. Let's turn up the difficulty. The risks are mighty, but so are the rewards. Uh... There aren't any rewards. Because this training mission isn't meant to be fair. It's designed to crush your spirit while stress testing our new gun crafting system. Mind blaster. Blazing repeater, and that's a fire rate bonus. I don't really want that. Jet engine module. Ex oh, extra damage boost in the engine direction. I should probably look at some of these. Be interesting to pick up some grenade launchers, maybe. Lava container's not no good. What about modding? Haven't heard of any, to be honest, so I, I, I can't... Uh, I can't say anything on that one. Energy loot plus 20%. I'm actually gonna read what these do now. We actually haven't bought it. Have we? We bought an energy firework, didn't we? I think we did. We know what chain gun does. Bounce plus one. Shotgun should be obvious to everybody. Extra spread, extra gravity. And then heavy blaster is just that. Okay. Got the energy fireworks and another pulse box. I might be able to do some weird business with this. Okay. Oh, I know what I can do. I'm not going to be able to do it yet. Probably. Never mind. More pulse. So in that case, uh, let's go back for a second. Remove, remove that. Attach mode. I want to make a gun that is actually a problem. I'm probably going to die here. Straight up. Okay, energy fireworks is a little bit bigger than I thought it was going to be. All right, let's just do a line blaster. Finish crafting. Uh, oh, new gun. So I can have uh, I can have a secondary gun here. Well, I don't have any connectors, so let's just do let's just do a shotgun in the left left hand. There we go. I was wondering about that, how I could actually fire out of the left hand, and they both have separate energy meters. That'll help. But yeah, I don't know if they're gonna do modding. That would be lovely, uh, but I I don't know and I can't tell you. I wish I could. Actually, before we go in, I can't see how many people are watching me right now. There we go. There's the numbers. Boop. Let's see. Yeah, honestly, having the ultra cheap, the having the ultra cheap shotgun is actually incredibly helpful. Uh, kind of gives me constant fire rate, so I can deal with the little guys. 
Uh, let's see, do we have enemy? Oh yeah, we got some friends. Oh, I've got enough kickback that I can fly. Yes! This is probably going to be a consistent strategy for me. Um, one gun, uh, one one light gun, one really heavy gun. Um, it makes a massive difference when it comes to uh, when it comes to like going around. I might turn down the sound effects too. This is a bit punchy. Uh, let's see, are we done? I think we are. I don't see any more enemies in here or loot. Well, let's get out of here. I'm gonna. Okay, modding is on the list of plans, but not confirmed for launch. All right, I'm fine with that. Uh, let's see. Let's, let's turn down the sound effects a bunch. Ooh, like half. There we go. It's very hard to get. Um, so I'm going to turn up the music. Do oh man, I'd love to know if Joe's brother is doing the music again. And I guess I can also turn voices all the way up. I'm sorry, I didn't realize that this game started at reasonable audio levels as nice opposed work. to. I'd be impressed, except I was beating live fire ranges before it was cool. Trust me on that and don't ask the Admiral. Or Wilkinson. Or anyone else. I'm pretty sure even the Colonel's training room simulation time was, in itself, simulated. What he lacks in field experience, he makes up for in excellent listening skills. Yes, I was the fastest, most bullet dodgy person ever to complete this course. I was so good, they don't let me back on the course these days. Okay, let's just go back out there. I'm just gonna want to collect some connectors so I can make uh, old righty better. The hell are you? I have no idea. It does seem like the shotguns might be a little bit on the strong side. Okay. Laser, disco. And the gates of hell. Alright. Is that it? Oh, yes. Nope. One second. We're not done. Hell yeah. Oh, I love the, uh... Can I... Okay, I can... I can get around those. And it looks like we've got some friend bits. I think I might actually get rid of the, um... The pulse line. They're very slow. I don't mind... Well... That's probably where I'm getting most of my punch from, though. Hard to say. What I kind of want to have is... rooms? You must have crafted something pretty impressive. I'd say you're almost ready to help us take on the mother gunship. Maybe you do deserve some sort of reward. Wilkinson, do we have anything we could use as a reward? Is the answer to that going to involve me doing more work? It's not work, if it's what your heart longs to be doing, officer. What? My heart didn't long for any of this. Onward, soldier. We'll see what we can do. Okay, uh, let's see. Reward not guaranteed. I'm gonna keep going with this. Unfortunately, we're not getting a, a whole lot of tokens here, so I can't make my uh, gun any more ridiculous than I have been. Either that or I'm just totally missing the, the tokens along the way. Oh, this looks fun. Oh, that initial load time is a bit scary. That probably won't be a problem. Oh, I'm so glad the flamethrower dudes do not have nearly as much turning as they did in the previous game. Oh, don't go through the lava. That's a stupid idea. Let's see. Got anything else around here? Nope, that was actually the end of it. Ow. Nope. I hear at least one enemy. I guess we just had to wait for them to spawn. That's a tough sucker. What else do we got? Uh, spin bots. Are both out? No. Ow. Where? Oh. You're just hiding out back there. Sneaky. How's my health doing? Doing fine. So far, Seven at least. chambers cleared. Keep going. Just imagine the most tasty reward you can. We'll make it happen. By we, he means me. I'm not sure why this credit is being spread around. Didn't you once tell me that you were a championship baker? I'm providing you the opportunity to reach a new audience with your craft. What you asked me to make is an affront to all things baking. It's blasphemy! I don't think you could ask for a better hook than that. Keep that culinary mystery in your mind, soldier. It's fuel on the field. Keep going. I want to say I actually got a cookie from Joe's wife when I met them at PAX. I know I got a hug bot. I want to say I got a cookie, too. It was like cookies and hug bots. They were a very cute copy. Uh, copy. Couple. Okay, um... 
I'm really satisfied with what I've gotten. Mainly, I'm too dirt poor to do too much with it. Apart from maybe turning this into more of a hell cannon. How much are shotguns? There are three. How many shotguns can I strap together? Do I want to do that? Because I'm not actually too fan. Yeah. Okay. Let's let's see what kind of horrors I can I can do to this. Let's let's remove half of these. Okay. Toggle attach mode. Oops. Toggle attach mode. Okay, how many shotguns can I cram on here now? Barrels. They might not all be shotguns. Now that I'm thinking about it, I might not actually have that many shotguns. Okay, let's go back. Let's mess with this one. I'll go remove mode. Uh, toggle attach mode. I'm going to switch this one over to... Probably just a basic chain gun. Nothing fancy. Uh, finish crafting, go back to this one. Okay, so I can fit two two shotguns on easy. Then after that, it's going to be a problem. Mainly just because I don't have any more. I can do more pulse boxes, but we kind of already know they're not that exciting. Oh, jeez. Energy fireworks are big. Okay. Connectors. Can I... Energy fireworks. Energy fireworks. And we'll just do... I could do a chain gun. Let's do a line blaster. I effectively want this sucker to... Uh, oh. Oh, dare, dare we. I want this to be like a... Fire once, and then to ignore it for a while. Well, this is downright worrying. We'll see how this goes. Probably badly. Wander's favorite to shotguns. I love shotguns. They're they're my jam. I don't have to worry about aiming them. The projectiles fly at a reasonable speed. Oop! Might be um I might be overstressing it a little bit. Yeah, part of the problem is a lot of the enemies like to be uh above me. Makes it kind of hard for... Ow! Ugh. I don't even know what the hell that was. I'm kind of killing myself. Oh, maybe this has some health for me? Oh, yeah, it does. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm near death. Let's see if you got some more health for me. Thank you. Yeah, so, um... The... The... Launchers, they're probably good, especially later. Um, it's great if you've got a height advantage on enemies, but if you don't, that's eh, kind of tough. Okay, um, is there anything else in here that I should even pay attention to? The answer looks like no. I okay, that door that door is open. That's good. Eight chambers, and we have your reward. We're happy to present you with a one of a kind treat, never before seen. Are you ready? My gungeoneering license will be revoked for this. <laughs> it's a chocolate chip cookie pie. Only we didn't have flour on board, so we used cement. And we didn't have chocolate chips either, so we substituted bullets. It's a bullet cookie pie made of cement. And it's also moderately similar to whatever tasty treat you might have wanted. When the two are compared on a cosmic scale, uh, <laughs> can I break it? The answer is no. That's unfortunate. Okay. I'm going to get a heavy blaster and a shotgun. And then I'm probably going to save my, my gibbs. Oh. No, wait. Um, am I done? It won't let... Huh. Am I done? I can't leave... Well, I think we've had enough time on the range today. Great work, recruit. I'll see you back here soon when we can finally take the fight to the mother gunship itself.
Perhaps there'll even be more baked goods. That was actually horrifying. That was kind of loud. <laughs> oh well, yeah, enlist your friends in online co-op. Yep, I mean, pretty much everything I sort of said when I mumbled over it, but uh, I'm really looking forward to this game. And I'm really glad that this demo actually is a... Uh, I want to say it's a... I want to say, no, I, I can absolutely say it's a great indication of how this game is going to go. So the demo is going to be available uh, in probably within the next 12 hours, give or take. Um, I don't entirely know when it comes out, um, but uh, the game will be the game. The demo will be available. I think it's free for everybody and you can just mess around. Um, and I highly encourage you to do so. Uh, it's just a lovely, lovely game. Lovely roguelike. And I just, I can't sing its praises enough. I mean, admittedly, I wasn't singing its praises very well because I was too busy uh, experiencing it. Um, but I think I'm actually going to do a couple more of these demo runs uh, just to see what kind of stupid guns I can come up with. Yeah, let's go do that. Like right now. <laughs> 